Hello, and thanks for joining me to this short video regarding PV planning with Polysum. In this video, we're going to design a system similar to this one. As you can see, Polysum allows nice 3D visualizations of complex systems. Now, let's start our project here. As you can see, Polysum SPT is in a web application that guides you easily to the next step. So I've started this project in Winterthur in Stadthausstraße 125. And I will click on save to guide us to the next step. Now I'm, I arrived at the roof planner. This is a central part of Polysun where you can choose your roof and draw it, for example, from Google Maps. So I will click on customize to draw a roof that's somewhere between a hip roof and a ridge roof. I will enter a building height and a slope to quickly start this off. Also, Polysun allows the calculation of the snow load related to data that you can find from, from the maps. And the next step is to draw and import this, this building from Google Maps. And we will now have a closer look on this one and draw it. For the drawing, I use guiding lines, which I position along the edges of the building. And now I can draw the rectangular, the rectangular outline of the building by holding shift to align the rectangle. The next step will be to, to draw the ridges of the building, where I follow the lines that we can see here in Google Maps. And I will draw them until every and each line is drawn. Perfect, already done. Now I click on Save and the building is is drawn, I click again on save. And now I'm in the next step where I can select PV modules. I will select from my favorites, but we also have a big module catalog where you can select from. I will set, select the module for all roofs, and now I can define the, the construction. The, I will just choose the current one for this case and choose it for all the PV modules. Now I arrived at positioning where I can see the roof. I can have a closer look, draw the building. I can even go into the three scene, 3D scene total where I can see how the building is positioned in the city by displaying Google Maps. I can hide all the other buildings so I can perfectly see how the building fits in into the, the city. And in case I want to remove some modules, for example, to make space for chimney or windows, I can also do that directly here. For example, I can, I can, I can get rid of this module, this module, and I can show the background image to know what's actually behind these modules. There's also the possibility to draw, to draw interference areas directly here and that can re refer to the chimney or windows. You can also do that in the, in the planning section earlier. I'm not going to deeper into this now. Let's have a look at another central part of Polis and SPT, which is the e-designer. Here you can start a planning where you can add all the roofs that are in your project, in this case four, and you can add a inverted dimensioning layout automatically by clicking here. You can select your favorite inverted manufacturer. I'm just using SMA now for example purposes. I click on calculate variations and Polison automatically suggests the perfect inverted layout for your roof. I click on use variations and it is used. Now we can additionally add consumers and we have plenty of profiles to choose from, for example, the residential profile, which you can scale up to the necessary amount, of annual consumption, I click on save, and now I can click on simulate. So the data is now sent to our service site where the, where the calculation takes place. And you will receive your results in like one minute maximum. Once the simulation is done, we can, for example, click on yield values to have a tabular view where we can see the PV generator power, specific annual yield, and also the total consumption of our, our consumer. Or we can have a look at the output graphs to have a nice visualization where you can see the photovoltaic yield each month 
the, the feed into the grid and the self-consumption. Once all of it is done, we can click on the section output and we can generate a report that we can distribute to our partners and customers. In this case, I will create the report for the whole project. So I click on project report multiple roofs and I again, I will wait up to one minute so the report is generated. Once the report is done, it will download automatically and you can open it as a PDF in a, your PDF viewer. As you can see, it not only contains the location data, but also data related to the roof, data locate, related to the positioning of the, of the PV modules, and also the energy analysis that we have seen earlier. All right, perfect. Feel free to go on our website and to download a free trial version for Polis and SPT. And don't hesitate to contact us if you have any other question. See you soon. Bye-bye.